from a distant land in the east.
Oh my god, it is. <laughs> I never do that, right, Chan? Uh, I muted it on the microphone level, which is super weird for me. I usually mute it in the program. Sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much for, for letting me know. Um, how are you doing, Raichan? What I was saying... Let me double back. We're playing some Shenmue 3 tonight. Um, I just want to uh, apologize and hopefully let everyone know that hopefully we have fixed the streaming issues that we ran into previously because we were dropping a bunch. So you went on about something and no one heard it. Yeah, that's that's my life. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> God, it's sad, but it's true. So, <laughs> uh, essentially I was saying that we did a we did a Ring Fit adventure stream a while back. And uh, I think the problem, the, the issues that's been causing my stream hiccups started then. So essentially, I had to take all my computer, my everything, and I hauled it out into my main room so that I would have enough space to do the Ring Fit Adventure stream, because I need the exercise space to do it. But then when I put everything back in my room, I think I set it up differently, and I thought I was being smart about it, so I tried to, like, rejigger how my power bars were set up and everything, and I think what I ended up doing is plugging both my power bars into the wall, and then I was left with... Uh, some additional stuff that I plugged in that to them, but also my modem, my, my modem router, and I plugged that into a power bar, and I was like, oh, this is great. Um, I don't have to run a power bar from the other side of the room or something. So I did that, and then little did I know, you can't, you can't do that. You can't plug a modem into a, into a power bar. I was talking to the, uh, tech support from my ISP, and, um, they said, like, yeah, you, if you do that, you're uh, you're not getting consistent internet because the it's the, the your modem isn't getting consistent power, so it like fluctuates, which means you can potentially drop more often than not. Uh, so I think that's what it was. So I literally just plugged the modem into the wall, and it, so far it's been okay. Um, I did an extensive test yesterday. I was at a family get together. Um, I ran. Uh, uh, someone was was kind enough to give me. Uh, a key to their like test stream channel so I set that up and I was streaming just a high intensive game on my console with the full streaming setup and I streamed it for like five hours straight and I got home and there was zero hiccups with like excellent quality no no error reports so I was like yes I think I think that's it so hopefully tonight we're good no more missed gameplay if it happens again at this point then I'm going to need to look at replacing my router because it might just be toast at this point. But anyways, long-winded explanation. Uh, Raichan, how is your night going? <laughs> Are you ready for some chill Shenmue 3 vibes? Let's go to sleep. I missed a conversation with Shenwa there, which is unfortunate, but... I haven't really figured out anything new, I don't think, so she probably wouldn't have much to say. Uh, I don't remember what the last thing we were doing was. Not bad. It's now 1.35 a.m. at the moment. Oh, my God. What are you do, doing still up? <laughs> do you not have anything going on tomorrow? Oh, that's crazy. Oh, no free apples this morning. I see how it is. I don't have to work, so it's it's okay. Nice. That's great. What did you do with your, uh, with your day off today? Found Lee Hei Hall. Lee Hei Lee Hui Hall. Lee, Lee Hua Hall. I can't remember. How, Lu, Lu Hui Hall. I think that's it. Uh, welcome to Lu Hui Hall again tomorrow. Or come to, sorry. I'll meet, uh, Sue at, uh, Lu Hui Hall today. I'll find it on Blossom Road. Okay, right. We were going to go talk to the master there who had said he dealt with them before I was working earlier. Oh, okay. How late do you work? Do you work, like, evening shifts? Traveler's note. Seriously, what's up with this? They're not giving me free apples anymore? Do they know I'm loaded on food? Wait, do I have apples from yesterday? No, I don't. What's up? What? Come on now. What would amaze me in this game is if the front desk lady comments on the fact that I didn't get free apples. This room is absolutely filthy. 
Can't they move us? Wait. Okay, okay, I'll do something about it. Just calm down, all right? I want a luxury suite. A suite? <laughs> Don't make me repeat Oh, it is myself. a different. Oh, Clean, spacious, they're going to do this every morning now. <laughs> queen like me. Nothing but the best for you. Yo, what's up, Imagine? How's it going? Ooh, yes, the first day of Hanukkah. Appropriate, very appropriate. I uh uh I lit the uh the menorah yesterday with my family at uh at a little Christmas get together. Cause like hey, ha half my family is yeah. Jewish. You need to pay for your room tonight. Oh my God, don't Krieg! Tell me you don't have any cash. <laughs> What's no, up, Krieg? I do. Absolutely gorgeous uh, beauty, you. no you. <laughs> I was looking through the IRL pictures today, just scrolling when I was uh, bored, and I came across your muscular self, and I was like, God dang, this lad's been working hard. Good morning. <laughs> morning. Be careful out there. <laughs> Didn't even know. Hmm. I'll give Those it to you though. You knew. On some level yeah, you knew. I know. You should watch out too. Right. Stay away <laughs> from anyone suspicious looking. Then come find me. Okay, I will. All right. So, what is the first order of business? Ren, we don't we don't care about you, Ren. You do your thing. Let's head to that temple. We're in it to win it. I live a double life. My normal life and my lift life. <laughs> your swole AF life. Actually, you know what? You did you you did inspire me, Krieg. I'm not gonna lie. So we have a lot of streaming to do tomorrow, like a lot. Oh, actually, let me run that down for you tomorrow. So tomorrow we have uh, a full day, pretty much. But right now it's marked down as 1 p.m. Dark Siders Genesis, which is absolutely true. Um, but I think at eight is listed for Hellblade right now. That might not actually happen, depending on how amazing and how into Darksiders Genesis so uh, me and Tessa are. Because it's literally our favorite franchise ever, and this is the first co-op game. So we're both, like, talking to each other, and we're like, we're beating this game in one day. Like, you sit your butt down at your computer, you're not getting up. Make sure you're all snacked up, you're not moving. So, <laughs> depending on how that goes... Hellblade might just get eaten up, but then there's another slot later uh, where it'll get slaughtered in, um, I believe, uh, uh, later in the week. The thief! Somebody help! Somebody catch him! Stop there! All right, now I'm saving these two. Oh God, they're gonna do a quick time thing. That's companionship. <laughs> I'd like to think so. It's going to be jolly as heck. But yeah, so I, I'm, I'm probably, I'm definitely streaming like literally all day starting at one. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. I'm going to jump it. No, wrong one. Oh, and then Rio died. <laughs> oh, perfect. Oh, he just had to ruin everything. Oh, dang it. <laughs> you could have just. Uh, I guess you could stumble down the stairs. Maybe the table is the best bet. X? Nope, up. Ah. See, I feel like in the old games there was like actual rules to these things. Like whenever somebody jumped, you knew to press X. Definitely in Shenmue 2. And this game, I feel like, like there is some rules. Like I'm still going up over a thing, but I feel like they're, they were better about it in old games. So you could predict. Oh God. Oh. How are you doing this? Oh. <laughs> Don't 
Don't kick the old man in the water. Oh. <laughs> Where are you going? They're at the end of a dock. Are you jumping in the water? Thank <laughs> you. Oh no, not fish. Oh dang it. <laughs> you know what? I almost want to fail all these. It's kind of great. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so you got punished for something the thief did? I guess, yeah. <laughs> I guess. That bench press I did at 185 that I shared, I seem to struggle a lot with. But just last Monday, I hit three reps of the same weight. Good stuff. Dang, that's really good. Congrats on that. What? Oh my god, it's still going. No! No! Real! <laughs> Sorry, bud. You're not so good at these events. <laughs> a bunch of hilarious video. Okay, I'll click it in a second. All right. All right, come on. I can, I can be on top of this. Let's go. Oh, no! Wait, did I do it? Nope. Ah! <laughs> yes, and then he sunk to the bottom of the sea like a rock. <laughs> Is it square? I don't remember. Okay, and then triangle. Yeah. And then down. Oh, this. You wanna die, Chris? This is the guy we saw at the beginning. Yeah, I was gonna say he's gonna be a kung fu master. Who are you? As you can see, just a cormorant fisherman. Oh, okay. Wait, what? I'm not. I'm not interacting with him. We're just going back. Okay. The later future master. Oh, I guess I have to deliver it. To Excuse him. me. Huh? What is it? Would you please give this to the couple in 207? What? Please. Uh, fine. Uh. I have to talk to Mr. Shu at Liu He Hall. Finally. Jesus Christ. We were just trying to start our morning. And then we had to go through all that. That's fine. <laughs> How was your day today, Krieg? I don't think I asked. What'd you get up to? Oh, let me check out this video. Uh, let me just see what it is. Oh! I've seen this. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is so funny. <laughs> Yeah, they literally hit every possible thing. I remember that. I'm going to watch that later. <laughs> I remember the guy's laughter, too. Like, he's just dying. <laughs> it's really good. That one is even better, though, because it lets you... Uh, you You can just keep going. The quick time event doesn't demand that you stop. And like retry it. You can just fumble your way through all of those. <laughs> Which makes it so much better. All I do is play Bruce of the World. 
How is some Brutha the world? Have you beaten any of the temples yet? This is the only thing I want them to patch out. This is it. Just that. Right there. <laughs> but in both sections. Just patch that right out. Please. Alright. Yo, I'm here. Where's your master? Excuse me. Hit me. Why did she say that again? Oh my god. <laughs> I beat a divine beast so far? Nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry, that's, that's what I meant. Got Just it. went through a pitch black Thanks maze the with the torch. Oh, I remember that. That's awesome. That's like in the open world too, right? Wait, what'd she say? He's inside? I'm looking. He's in. Okay. Yeah, that, w that was super cool. Hello. Nice. Are you Mr. Sure? Yeah. What do you want? <laughs> I heard you fought off the red snakes in New Paradise. I think this man is literally the same as the dude in Bailu Village. He's just missing his beard. You Japanese? Uh, yes. But his, like, model is the and same. Do you do martial arts? I do. Then why don't we talk with our fists? Uh oh. I'd love to see a Japanese fighting style. I'll tell you anything you want to know after that. Anything? Yeah. Well, I mean, anything I know, at least. Let's do this. Wish I'd eaten, but okay. Oh, you just want to spar with me? Oh my god, they want me to really lay into this guy. Nice. My use of skills is too sluggish. Boo. Is that text on screen saying goop? What? No? <laughs> what? No, good. <laughs> Just goop. <laughs> yeah, promise is a promise. I hear you fended off the red snakes in New Paradise. They were threatening the folks at the Muren Cafe. What did they look like? There were two of them. One was thin, and the other was big as a panda. The same pair that was at the bustling diner. So, you've met them already. They're called Lu and Shung. 
Yeah. Wait. So you're the out of towner that helped out the dry goods vendor? Yeah, I guess. I heard about that. Let me thank you as well. It wasn't anything. This guy just Red makes me feel happy just by looking into his eyes. Out, he has like these big, glossy, beautiful, bad shiny bad. eyes. He's like the only character in the game that looks like that. But there's nothing oh my I god, look at his eyes. An entire gang. I just want to swim are. in the there's ocean the that is his gaze. They often <laughs> the golden goose. Oh, he's wearing repping sandals too. I didn't even notice. The golden goose, eh? Okay. The venture area in New Paradise called the Golden Goose seems to be where the red snakes hang out. Check out the golden goose. All right. Well, I'm not done with you yet. Where is it? Hi, Mister Sure. Oh, it's you. Do you have a moment? Oh, uh -huh. what's up? I'm trying to get to the Golden Goose in New Paradise. The Golden Goose, huh? Just walk toward all the busy shops lined up on the promenade. Okay. You'll see a shop selling ice cream on your left. I remember it. Huh? Ice cream? Yup. Nice and cold, sweet, tasty ice cream. Great. But what about New Paradise? Oh, shoot. Uh, sorry. The entrance to New Paradise is right in front of that shop. Okay. Ah, okay. Oh, Thanks. is it the shady one? It might be that shady back alley thing. Was that called New Paradise? I can't remember. Oh my god, look at all these kids training. Oh, this is awesome. Oh my god, the one kid, the two kids in the middle are just giving it their all. Oh, and this girl in green. Oh, my God. Look at her go. <laughs> They're all going at I love that. Just in the middle of the street. Okay. I know where the ice cream shop is. We got to double back quite a bit. Oh, wait. Oh, it's just this? Oh, never mind. Oh, no, no, that's the bowling alley. Yeah, the ice cream shop has got, like, some pretty colorful front thing. <laughs> Smart and lucky. Lion smart ball, smart and funny. So we have shop names. Sushi heaven. Okay. Is this not the promenade? Phantom's mask. Oh, wait, short what? Short break? I have no idea. I don't remember being this far down. Oh no, that was the Rose Garden is the fighting place. Well, where the heck is the ice cream? I remember seeing it for sure. Hold on, we need to ask for directions. Uh, hello. Excuse me. Hey there, cutie. Welcome. Oh. Take a good look around and let me know if anything catches your eye. <laughs> I will purchase all of your shoes for compliment. Do you know where New Paradise is? Oh, you're only asking me for directions. <laughs> I wanted to get to know you. Too bad. Uh, hi. <laughs> New Paradise is just above the promenade. <laughs> Do you know the arcade so, the, the best part is that 
Rio definitely has, like, there's okay. a budget for the Thanks. amount of dialogue they can record and have in the game. Like, a thousand percent. And the fact that you can speak to everyone, and this is applied to all the Shenmue games, it just particularly stands out in this one, which is really funny. But they just have to pull on lines that they, like, think might be acceptable. Because <laughs> they can't just keep creating new ones for every possible conversation he can have. So there's a point where you hit a wall. You have to give the NPCs personality. So they have to say, like, quirky and fun things. And then the only thing Ryo can say is, uh, hi. <laughs> uh, sorry, I need I need more directions than that. Excuse me. Hey, bro. Doing some sightseeing? Hey, bro. You're here to have fun, right? Where's the ice cream, bro? Do you know the way to New Paradise? Buy some tokens. No. Then you can use them to party like crazy. You're no. here to have fun, right? No, I'm here to get ice cream. Sorry, but I don't have time to chat right now. Life is all about having fun. <laughs> get stuck going through the motions, and you'll be an old geezer before you know it. Money is there to be spent. Am I right? Right. Listen, dude, if you don't want to tell me where I can buy ice cream, that's fine. I'll go elsewhere. Isn't this the promenade? Hello, you know. Excuse me. Welcome! Our mooncakes are sweet. Have you seen delicious. the heavy race Sean glitch? Yeah. Want I have. To try one? <laughs> Do you know where New Paradise That's a good is? one too, Greg. New Paradise. <laughs> I've never New actually played Heavy Rain, I've just seen a lot of it. If you make and unfortunately the I I had the game like hundred oh, percent spoiled for me, so Okay. Thanks. Wait, what'd she say about it? I missed all Excuse that. Do you know where New New Paradise is up past the promenade? If you make your way up the promenade, there should be an. Ar it's across from that. Thanks. Oh, it's that area, right? Okay. Same here, and I wanted to play it too. It's long past that point. I I don't even want to play it anymore. <laughs> I don't think I'm into, uh, who's that developer? Um, uh, who develops those? Oh, it's not Media Mole, no, it's not Media Molecule. Why do I keep wanting to say that? Um, oh, I can't remember. Oh, the Golden Goose, here we go. I have some questions. Excuse me. Hello there. I'm not. I don't think I'm super into really any of their, their games. It's just not my my cup of tea. I hear the red snakes come by here. I I keep I'm saying I want to play through it with a friend. Oh, quant nature. Quantic Dream. Yes, ah, yes, yes. Okay. Um. I uh I keep saying I want to play through some of those games with a friend, and we would just try and make the worst decisions we possibly can throughout all this playthrough. That's that's the only way I see myself. Like enjoying it. <laughs> yeah, trying to like kill every character as fast as you can. <laughs> That's how we would run through it. My apologies, I cannot answer that. Hmm. Cannot answer that. Listen, someone's gonna answer that. Um. Greetings. Welcome to the Golden Goose, your palace of pleasure. Do you require assistance? Yeah, where are the red snakes? No thanks. If you what? have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. Rio, I literally have a question. Ask her. What are you doing? How dare you? Pardon me. Yo. Welcome to the turtle race, the pride and joy of our shop. Is it? Please enjoy yourself. I hear the red snakes come by here. Is that true? I'm not at liberty to answer questions of that nature. Dang. <clears throat> ah well, enough talk. How about a round? Ah, uh, negative. No. Thanks though. All right, someone knows this lady's blocking the stairs over here. There, there's some red snake business. Ah, here we go. Cutscene. Welcome. Do you have a VIP card? VIP card? That's right. The room up ahead is for Golden Goose VIPs only. Hmm. 
VIPs have their own room? How, How does do one become a member? <laughs> <laughs> How does one obtain a you VIP fill out an card? application and submit it to the Golden Goose. <laughs> the process takes about two months in all. What? Two months? Isn't there some way to speed up the process? Well, there is. But first you would need a referral from a VIP. Just tell me who to talk to. I'm afraid that's simply impossible. We must respect the privacy of our valued members. Hmm, of course. I mean, with the rate you do things, Rio, waiting two months isn't honestly that bad. <laughs> uh... Alright. So, it can take two months to become a VIP. You get a faster referral from a member. Find a VIP member. Alright, so who who would know about VIP, chat? More like the silly goose. Oh my god, are you serious? Look at this. They turned Kickstarter backers into freaking lucky hit boards. Oh my god, this is just crazy. There is so much Kickstarter stuff everywhere in this city. <laughs> That is really... I'm not against it. It's really funny. If I was one of these faces, that would be... I would be so honored. This guy loves it. She loves it. He's just, like, trying to be Rio. <laughs> That's so good. Okay. Uh, who do we need to talk to? This guy? How do we get a VIP card? Me. Cough up the what names. Can I do for you? Can you introduce me to one of your VIP members? That is not a request with which I can comply. I see. I see. Alright, so someone, like, working in the area is gonna see VIPs coming in and out. Uh, this cinematic photo guy, he's, like, too uptight, so he's not gonna, like, he's not gonna let, let slip those names. This dude, though, he sees some stuff... He doesn't care. He's out for himself. He knows. I'm sorry. <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, welcome. Could you do something for me? Huh? He's living his best life. <laughs> I got a date with a girl from the cafe next door. I see. I want to give her a present and ask her to be my girlfriend. Have you but gone on said I don't date know yet? What she likes. What should I give her? Please, could you ask her what she likes? <laughs> Sure. Will do. Really? This kind of thing has to be a surprise, so I can't ask her myself. <laughs> Make sure you ask her casually. Uh, I'll that's not my best. That's not gonna happen. Thank you. <laughs> Rio is gonna march up to this lady and be like, "Hello, I've heard the man next door would like to date you and possibly make you his girlfriend." Are there things that you like that perhaps he could purchase for you in order to obtain your affection? <laughs> buy? I don't want to buy anything. What do you have? I don't want your instruments. You're selling a guitar for 900 bucks? I don't think so, bucko boyo. Oh, the keyboard. That's something I really want to learn how to play. That is my dream. Ugh. If I had more time, one day I'm going to learn how to play the keyboard. A thousand percent. Look at this thing. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm going to learn it. I want to make my own jams. And you can do anything on a keyboard. The world is your oyster. Oh. Swing by whenever and have another look. Listen, dude. I need you to answer some questions. Excuse me. Hey, come and take a look at our hottest instruments. We have all the latest models. Do you know anyone who's a Golden Goose VIP? You mean the people who go into the basement? They all look rich. Rich people like that have stopped by, but they never buy anything. Okay. Thanks. He might cough up some more info if I help him. 
So he's trying to date this lady. Sorry. Don't you want to take a break? Come on, have something sweet. <laughs> no. Excuse me. Uh, actually, what? I was oh, wondering please, what kind of me. things you enjoy. I'm just so happy. Did something good happen? <laughs> excuse me, I'm well, just so happy. Mr. Joe from next door has asked me out on a date. Right. I wonder where we'll go. I wonder what he likes. I can barely contain my excitement. What kind of things do you like? Huh? <laughs> well, I like a lot of things. But I'd have to say I like flowers the best. Flowers? Yes. Flowers can make your day so much brighter just <laughs> by being there. Rio, you I are see. not smooth at all. Thank you. Huh? I C see. Come again? Alright, dude. She likes flowers. <laughs> it wasn't that hard. Excuse me. Finally. How'd it go? Did you find out what she likes? Yeah. She likes flowers. Flowers? What kind of flowers? Huh? Maybe I should open up a flower shop. If it's not too much trouble, could you find some flowers then for me? Then you with I see. would send to someone you like. <laughs> I can't leave the shop right now. Will do. Thank you. By the way, we got Whoa. brand new models what? in. Want to have a look? It looked like all the guitars just changed when the camera cut. Weird. No, I'm good. I've also got all the latest models. Okay, they, they didn't, but that was strange. Uh, wait, so what do you want me to do? Excuse me. Finally, did you get... Not yet. Real. If it's not too much trouble, could you find me some flowers that are good? I will do. Thank you. By the way... No. Uh, I don't know where to buy flowers. If we see them, I'll grab them. Uh, who else knows? This dude looks rich. Excuse He's a VIP. Me. How about uh, a nice new hat? I'll pick one out for you. I can't talk to him. Do you know anyone who's a Golden Goose VIP? I'm talking to I one right now. I count some among my customers. But there's no way I'd ever point them out to a stranger like you. Um, okay. Thanks anyway. You'd be better off asking the gentlemen down at the port. port? They occasionally come here to unwind. The port, huh? Got it. Thanks for the tip. Wait, which port? This is definitely a VIP. Look at this guy. Look at this man. I'm jealous. <laughs> a little bit. I'm a little jealous. You can tell that that shirt's like a little bit fuzzy too. You named your horse Daddy Jake? Oh my God, Craig! I'm so honored. Thank you. That's amazing. That's incredible. I. You know what I. You know what I named my horse Craig? And I gave it. I gave it like a purple, beautiful, it was like a purple and pink flowing mane. Uh, it was a, was it a black horse? It might've been a black horse. I think it was, I think it was a black horse. But I, I like, I put all the golden ornaments on it. I dressed it up. It's beautiful and ornate. And I named it Salami. And I'd be like, <gasps> Come here, Salami! And then Salami would ride up. <laughs> I loved it. Salami, yeah. I was like, what's a good horse name? <laughs> and that's the first thing I landed on. <laughs> Clearly, I'm not, I don't race horses or anything. <laughs> but I just like, I knew I couldn't name it Epona. Because that's just too standard. So I was like, what? What's a what's a name? What's a, horses have weird names? And I was like, but what's a what's a, a one word sort of endearing name? Because I feel like so, a lot of horses have two word names. And I didn't want that. They'll be like, this horse's name is Ride the Lightning, and you're like, what? That's a that's a whole sentence. Like what? Or it'll be like, beautiful. No, it'll be like. <laughs> It'll be like Brown Thunder, or I don't know. They just have like weird names. But I didn't want it to be like extended. So I was like, what's like something nice <laughs> that I enjoy eating, I guess? Salami. <laughs> but 
Okay, port workers often go to the gaming area. They might know some VIP worker. What port? What? You have to be more specific. The promenade. I mean, if we're talking ports, then we gotta go. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Maroka? How's it going? How are you doing today? What is going on, good sir? Nothing much. Um, had a pretty chill day. Didn't do a heck of a lot. Did a little shopping. Came back. Had a nice little chat with my mom. Pretty standard stuff. <laughs> Just chilling out with some Shenmue now. What'd you get up to? Yeah, we're talking about Breath of the Wild horse names. Mororka, have you played Breath of the Wild? <laughs> well, Creed can tell you his name. I was saying that I named my horse Salami because I wanted it to be nice and simple. One word, something I enjoy, and something that I would have fun like calling for in the wild. I didn't want to go with a Pona because it's too standard. So I just imagine Link whistling and then being like, Salami! And then this big majestic horse <laughs> galloping up. <laughs> yeah, and Krieg honored me with my name as his horse. <laughs> Good Sunday here. Got done with the rest of my Christmas shopping. Oh, nice. Can you spoil what you got? I had to get my Secret Santa done. The gift was at the mall. Nice! What'd you get for your Secret Santa? I guess I can ask these fishermen. We're at the port, Excuse right? Excuse me. Uh, not even a bite. Huh? Are you here to fish too? Nah. But there's something I want to ask. Port. I'm trying to get to the port. The port? It's right there. Thank you very much. Oh, is it the, uh... I won't be worth anything if I don't eat. Oh, they mean the main port where people come in. Okay, um... Well, you know what? We can ask the dude that runs that stand. Because he said he knows everything about everything. And he would know if VIPs or whoever are coming and going. So let's go check with the, uh... Oh, the tourist guy. That's who it is. Although he's not there right now. Oh, yeah, he is. Uh, I haven't played it yet, but I've seen the playthrough. Nice. The co-worker I got, we didn't work together that often. Oh, yeah. So it was a bit of a difficult buy. Pardon me. She's 20. I had to cancel out the, when it comes to so to cancel spots, the booze. Oh. I'm your man. <laughs> As the tour guide around these parts, I'm your man if you've got any questions. What would you end up going with? As a tour guide, yeah. Actually, I have a question. A VIP member. Do you know anyone who might be a VIP at the Golden Goose? I don't really spend a lot of time there myself. I see. What? Dude, you're supposed to know everything about everything. Okay, well now I am physically at the port. Is there anyone here? Like, why would... Why would these vendors know anything? Seems kind of random. Oh, wait, this lady might. Oh, she's the greeter, right? Never mind. <laughs> she's she's just side eyeing me. <laughs> All right. Uh, who's like a fancy guy? Super tackle? No, no, no. We don't want a fisherman. Who who's who's got the fanciest stall? Millions served. Oh, they, they serve some fancy clothes. Okay. Excuse me. Hi there. How about a nice souvenir to remember now? I had some suggestions from, from a friend. Got her some earrings and a gift card to H&M. Nice. I will always say yes to an H&M uh, uh, H gift card. So that's a gift for me. I just have a question. Some stickers my friend made. Nice. Uh, VIP members. You know about them? Do you know them? anyone who's a Golden Goose VIP? I honestly That's don't sweet. Know. Did you do any of your like family okay. shopping or is that all done? Thanks anyway.
Uh, oh, okay, we found flowers. Aha. Excuse me. Good day to you. Let me know your budget, and I'll make the perfect bouquet or wreath for you. Okay. Actually, I have a question. Whatever could that be? What would you suggest for a first date? Is there a certain flower that's good to give to someone you like? Oh, do tell. Do you have someone in mind? Huh? Actually, I... <laughs> you don't have to say a word. I know a boy in love when I see one. For no, times okay. like this, just any old flower won't do. What you need is a dreaming maiden. Nice. That always dreaming feels maiden. good when you just blast it's through that. Flower given to court the one you love. But we don't sell them here. Huh? Dreaming maidens don't last long. They're prone to wilting. I don't know how to raise them. You have to give them soon after picking them. Where can I find them? They should be all around Nyawu. They grow in places with a lot of moisture. If you're going to look, I'd say you should start along the river. Thanks. While you're at it, won't you buy some of my flowers? Yes. Let me know your budget, and I'll make the perfect bouquet or wreath for you. Sure. What do you got? You got some nice stuff. A rose, you can't go wrong with that. We'll buy one of these, too. There you go. Okay, here it is. A single rose. That's fine. That's a nice thing, right? The Dreaming Maiden isn't sold in stores because they're too delicate. They grow along the river where there's plenty of moisture. Along the river. Okay. I mean, if, if anything, it's going to be down that way across the docks where we came from. Um, but we're not done here. Hold on. You you sell fancy flowers. Excuse me. What's up with these VIPs? Hello. Welcome. Looking for a gift for your girlfriend? Or perhaps your family? <laughs> Let me know your budget. <laughs> oh, and, and while I gave you all this information, buy some flowers. <laughs> Actually, everyone's for something else. everyone's out for that sale in this game. I'm gonna ask about this, and she's gonna try and sell me flowers at the end. Actually, I know a few who are regulars here. Oh, let me introduce them to you. Oh, oh wait, I don't really know their names or where they live. What? Okay, thanks. What do you mean? I don't see. <laughs> what? what did you just say to me? <laughs> you just contradicted yourself in two seconds. <laughs> All right, lady. Okay. All right. Wow, that was such a... All the promise was there. And none of the payoff. Wait, what if some VIPs are staying at the hotel? If they say they hang around at the port, they might hang around here. I'm going to ask front desk. Oh, you know what? The husband and wife are VIPs, and I returned the bag, so now they owe me. That's what it is. I got it. I got there. Excuse me. She knows. What do you want? Who is that couple? I need your help with something. VIP member. I figured them out. Do you know anyone who's a Golden Goose VIP? VIP? Yeah. Hmm. What's that? Oh, come on. Sorry. You know. You're asking the wrong person. I don't do...